Ukrainian forces are continuing to resist Russia's onslaught in the eastern city of Bakhmut, which has seen the longest running and bloodiest fighting since the war began. Both sides have sustained heavy casualties in the battle for control of the city that analysts say holds no great strategic value. But Ukraine's president says the city is symbolically important. He will sell this victory to West, to his society, to China, to Iran, to all the countries. He will sell it to his society. That was the first step. Now, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. I will, I will have this issue with Ukraine. Then another step, another step, another step. Zelensky visited the front line on Tuesday in a bid to boost his troops' morale. Speaking to reporters on the way back to Kyiv, he also revealed his intentions to revive dialogue with China. Of course, I gave all the diplomatic and public and not public to president of China, uh, to, yes, to leader of China, and I want to speak with him. Because I had, con I had contact with him before full-scale war, but during all this year, more than one year, I didn't have, and I really wait when our teams will uh, find like a solution. You, but no plans yes. at the moment? Yes. Okay. Yes. Would you invite him here to Ukraine? Oh yes, we are ready. We are ready to see him here. Ukraine's leader fears that if Russia conquers Bakhmut, Moscow may garner international support for a deal that could require Ukraine to make significant compromises.